Hello and welcome to episode 9 of Ark Survival. What was an aberration first impression has now turned into a uh, little series of me playing the game. Mainly because I didn't absolutely die in the first hour and I'm starting to enjoy the map. I am playing by myself, solo, completely default settings, except for my map location and floating combat text. Everything else is completely default gameplay. Let's jump into it. Um, <clears throat> so far, I've discovered that basilisks do spawn at the starting location. Um, it's not a glitch. This game is just really bad like that, making it the easiest place to spawn. Um, there are no raptors, luckily. Uh, though now I'm level 30, I'm kind of wishing I had more. My goal now is to raise an army of things to take out a basilisk, and if they don't die that would be amazing. Um, I do have a lot of uh, stegosauruses which I don't need. I find them very slow, uh, very weak, very squishy. I am hoping to get rid of them. <clears throat> but it's kind of all I had to be honest. Um, for now I'm making a wall, kind of walling off this base here. These are my three raptors, and I am very shy of an army, which I do need. <laughs> I'm really disliking Stegosauruses at base level. Um, in default games, they are very, very slow. I'm trying to get all my Triceratops to 1k HP, and then everything to at least 200 damage. Just what I think is a bare minimum to be uh, fighting. I've been stuck that whole time. Um, the Basilisk. I have started on a base that's not very big. And it probably will only remain one, one story. There we go, let there be light. Cool, I can see on learn stuff. Not really what I'm interested in. Alright. I guess now I just want to grab more metal and more wood, things that I actually need. <coughs> and things I need to finish off the wall. Uh, I've got Spike, who will be my main mount. Um, my current goal, I guess, is probably lead all the stegos I tamed to their deaths. Um, for a, probably a separate video, I'm not sure yet. Which will be a guide on how to kill the basilisks. <coughs> I will need to tame another dog for light. One of those guys. Once I can find a high level one. I did restore my um, settings for keybinds and I think it accidentally changed all my settings to be honest. So I am going to see if I can... Uh Go to Epic. Don't want motion blur. Um, sky quality can be medium textures, uh, medium shadows, medium shadows. Let's go with high view distance. Um, Let's 
Let's see how that goes. I'm not sure how it's going to stream, but we'll have a look. And it uh, might need a restart for that to work, so I'm just going to quickly exit my game. <coughs> and start it up again. Should be a nice quick load. I'm running at 2080, I've got 12 cores. <laughs> Everything is on epic or high, that's good. It's for shadows. Now I know it is quite dark in my stream. It is nighttime. But it should be daytime quite soon. <clears throat> Maybe I can tame this one right here. So apparently cook me turns it pretty quickly. And they usually poop and then they're ready to go again. I feel lights not actually on because that is really a pathetic little amount of light. If I did have a big circle before, I could have swore he did. <coughs> so with those guys, apparently you can have their charge time and their light um, distance. One more feed should do it. A lot of these big guys. Okay, Lamp. That is your name. I'm not sure if those stats are good or bad. So let's uh... There we go, that's a nice little circle of light. Now we have a personal lamp. Well, you are my main tank and you have nothing, do you? No. So you are definitely going to have to get more uh, health if you want to survive against the baddies. Hey there, the Dark Wolf. How's it going? Still trying to amass my army. Uh, see if I can uh, take on a um, basilisk with the uh, stegosauruses. Fingers crossed. It's an endgame tame, but I'm not sure how much damage its explosive breath does, which is something I probably should have looked up before I decided to go to war. But I'll live or I will die. My 
My base location is pretty tucked away, so... can go out. <clears throat> thatch I'm very low and I really should have got more thatch to it. I might actually do another trip to thatch. Um, how my raptor's doing? I need more cooked meat so it might be time for a hunt. That's a light bulb dog thing. Um, and this hideous thing is my light. Well, the sun's coming up now, but it's got a charge capacity, as you can see there, underneath health. And all the way at the bottom, where movement speed in, it's got an emission range. So if I make the range bigger, the circle of light is bigger. And if I make the charge capacity bigger, it charges more. The light's kind of useless during the day, so I'll turn that off. And you can sit over there somewhere. Can I chuck you in a window? Nope. <laughs> you can go sit with my other dino. Oh, you're on follow. I don't want you on follow. Um, Okay. All my tracks are now 1k health with high melee damage. I'm feeling more confident about taking on the um Oh look at you, even Rolly Polly's getting there. I'm not sure if I should settle those guys up. I don't know. If they just get one hit by the basilisk, that's just gonna be a massive waste of my resources. Um <clears throat> so I've got an egg. Quite heavy. Yeah, let's go have a look at the map. See what spawned overnight. Zero is my main. At least I get there eventually, huh? Eh? Alright, I cannot see the Bathos antennae. Is it here somewhere? Oh wow, maybe it isn't. I am level 47. Wow, okay. Would you look at that, level 47. I haven't even checked my skills because I haven't really needed to buy or use anything. I don't even know if there are die bears on this map, but explosives I think might be good against the basilisk. Um, a rifle will be good, which I've already unlocked. Chitin, I have not found anything with that. But I am sure I can put points into fortitude. Um, let's go see what's spawned. Are there any raptors around? Uh, None that I can see so far. Hopefully I've got enough speed to outrun a uh, basilisk if I come across one. 
Alright, so it was literally here yesterday and now I can't find it. I'm not sure if that's a good sign or a bad sign. Dare I? Oh, there it is. Right there, you cheeky cheeky. Level 28 Mother Queen Basilisk. Scary. Yeah, let's go uh, gather a bit of meat. Let my uh, kill squad get a kill. I think if we kill some of these guys. Oh, oh, oh. I see raptors, I might be able to upgrade my squadron. If I have 20 raptors, I reckon I might be able to take out the basilisk. Come on you guys, I know you know how to go straight through a door. Clever boys. Okay, let's get as much meat as we need. They're all staying put. How's your day being a Dark Wolf? Cold. Oh wow, no? We have a strong one here. third one is, so... Let's take it back up in case. Oh, I'm so glad I finally got some more raptors. I knew where the last one went though. Level 14 female. Um, I've got a metal pickaxe and I've started getting some nodes, but I don't have much metal. Uh, where is the last guy? Uh oh, I'm missing the other one I knocked out. Let me just find this other raptor and I will be with you. <coughs> hmm. Wow, it did go out here somewhere, didn't it? Or did it run away down here? Oh, there it is. Um, no, I don't have a lot of metal. I farmed maybe enough to make my crossbow, my pickaxe, my scythe, and my steel axe. And I've got about 10 sitting inside somewhere. <coughs> oh wow, plus 6 levels. 14. I think that female might be my highest level. Oh no, that's 16 and 14. But I guess we'll find out after they get tamed. So raptors can 
Jump. If you right click, they can jump on small dinosaurs and pin them down. Or on PvP, other people. Attack squad. And right click is just really, really quickly attacking. Um, in a group, they get uh, raptor bonuses. I think you can do a call as well. Or if you're a female, you might be able to do a call that makes everyone stronger. Oh, there it is. Uh, on the top right, you see that buff? Gas on it? What do you mean? Oh, that's a um, frenzy, I think. Um, so on the top right, if they're in a group of three or more, they get a pack bonus for how many are in the group. So their attack is like multiplied or something like that. Um, can you check in their stats? No, you can't. I don't think it says. Oh, that's new. Yeah, I don't think you can find out what buffs say, can you? Well, not that I'm aware of, anyway. Um, so where's my new one? Uh, level 13, level 13. Alright, they're both level 13. Oh, that one doesn't have a saddle, that must be the new guy. Um, it only came out last year, it's a new feature. Um, yeah, it's... Now, let's see what you have. Oh, wow, really weak. All your stats went into food and you're level 20, what a disgrace. Oh well. Your raptors, I'm not gonna complain. Now I feel like I'm a king. You know, with this bonus on the raptors and a stegosaurus tanking, I reckon I'd be able to take out the uh, basilisk. Well, I'm gonna go on an excursion to kill things. Um, but first of all, I need to get two extra saddles for them. So I think I'll need wood, fiber, and possibly thatch. So let's have a look at raptor saddles, R.A.P. So I need a lot of hide. And I can make exactly two. Who, the basilisk or the trek? I don't even want to google how much health a level one basilisk has, because there are two of them on this map. Hey Royal, how's it going? Um, so I'm guessing if I look up a basilisk stats at base, he's going to have a lot of health and damage at level 1. And this one's level 28, so... I'm pretty scared to go near him at the moment, even with the, the army I'm building. I'm not sure how much damage his fireball does, which is another reason I'm hesitant. If you guys know how much uh, health the uh, basilisk has, feel free to share it with me. Because uh, I'm basically just raising an army in case it comes to my door. Alright, let's see how much damage I can uh, dish out with a squad of raptors. Um, wow, 2.37k. Oh, that's not terrible. Alright, so this guy's level 28, which means, let's say he's got 10 more points in health. So he's probably around 5k health. I mean, this is a starting area. They would not make the starting area that hard. I mean, they could, but... Let's face it, why would they even put the Basilisk here anyway? Have you played much of this map before, Royal? And I appreciate the information. Alright, so that's all my raptors. Yeah, look, my strategy is my raptors are squishy. I've got four stegos, which are completely useless compared to the trikes, I think. So I'm just gonna put them in like fodder. And then send these babies off. Yeah. Oh man, look at that. Imagine being faced with that. There ain't nothing stopping these guys. Now I'm trying to clear, keep the path here clear. Just in case the basilisk like pins something and comes towards me. Yeah, 
So he's only doing 10 damage and I'm doing 40 times 6 at the moment. That guy was level 6 and that still took a while. You guys aren't gonna eat? What? Interesting, why aren't you guys eating? Are you all full? I must have whistled to disable item collection. Is there a whistle for that? No, there isn't. Hmm. Interesting. Why aren't you guys eating? Uh, your weight is pretty low. Um, behavior. Harvest settings. No, they got harvest settings on. Wow. I don't know. Interesting. Alright, let's uh, kill one or two more things. Uh, get some uh, levels into these guys. Come on. There we go. You should play Ark again. Probably not this map and probably not Scorched, Scorched Earth, but uh, definitely Ark in general. This is literally my first time. I've spent more than one hour playing this map. And I'm literally just so peed off at the Basilisk, I'm just trying to kill it. That's kind of my first goal of this game. I really want to know what happened to that last raptor. I think he's over there dead. I reckon he picked a fight with something bigger. Actually, it might be worth going that way and checking it out. Arc 2. Um, I've only played the island, the center, and a bit of Ragnarok. I haven't really played that many arcs. Oh, there's two of these. Let's have a look. As long as I get... What? Why are they attacking? Wow, that is really weird. So equals is aggressive. Um, all aggressive is subtract, yep. Wow. following my main raptor. Oh no, wait, no, they're following this guy. bugs. I don't know what's going on. Alright, let's try this again. Yeah, I don't know what's happening either. Let's try attacking something. Thanks for the follow, Divine Spear. Wow, they're not attacking. What? Why are they attacking? Check that out. And they're ignoring my follow command. Did I give a single command that overrided them? They're all on attack my target. Yeah, how bizarre is that? Wow, alright. 
Let's see if you'll attack something now. Alright, I might re uh, reload the game. Because this is very, very bizarre. I've never had that glitch happen to me either. Maybe, I don't think there's a limit to how many uh, things can attack either, so... Let's put that off the menu. Alright, so... I can't have anyone with under 500 health. Because as a raptor you will get slaughtered. Alright, let's try this again. Take two. Now let me just check and make sure that the full stop is attack. Um. Oh wait, period. Yeah, that's the full stop. Oh, I love Argentavis. I don't think there are any on this map though. There we go. That was really bizarre. Let's uh, try that again. So this is the guy I wanted to kill before. Get him boys. Wow. One second. I, I don't even know where the other one is. Oh we got the music here. Funky music. I'm trying to get there. I think I will need 50 just to kill the basilisk. If you know how much damage a Basilisk Flame Ball does, let me know. I'm pretty much Death Valley right now. Boom. Oh wow, this guy's strong. I might lose a Raptor. Level 13, wow. Okay, this guy has a lot of uh, a lot of health already. So once we're at 500, the goal is to get 200 health. Oh, this guy I'm riding is really squishy though. Look at him! He disintegrated before he hit the floor. Sorry, Rolly Polly. Oh, do you know much about the Basilisk? So this one's level 28. I'm just wondering how much damage the initial fireball does. Because um, I'm thinking if I get five stegos to charge at it from the front and then hit it from behind with the old razzle dazzle. I don't know what the bare minimum is to kill a thing to be honest. Like I wish I did. Yeah, I do, but I'm playing the game and I forgot to do it before I started the game. And I'm already in the game. Oh wow, that guy's doing the 61s now. That's a good damage. Alright. Let's uh, bring this hunt to a conclusion. Alright, that was a fun experiment. You guys ready to see me get my uh, army slaughtered by a uh, thingamabob? Basilisk? Yeah, I've got four stegos at the moment. <laughs> One, two, three. Oh, there we go. Wow, you're very squishy. You are too squishy to be in my army, buddy. I will collect all this delicious meat you've uh, got for me. I have no cementing paste at all yet. Uh, 
think the female of the raptor pack can be the one that uh, boosts the damage, but I'm not sure how it works. I can't remember off the top of my head. Um, so I've got... Stegos are too slow. I'm not sure how they're going to fare against the Basilisk. Like this one's almost got 2k health and no saddle. Oh, I didn't want to put that in health, my bad. Um, I think I'm going to also get some more Triceratopses. Because I think Trikes are a lot quicker. As you can see, everything's at 1k health. And if you're telling me that the Fire Blast has 1k health, that means they're going to be dead anyway, so... Yeah, hopefully there's a cooldown on the Fireball. If there isn't, I'd be very upset. Why are you burning during the day? Um, trike saddles. T R I. So I just need wood, which I don't have much of. Um, how do you tame a crab? I know you can tame the basilisk, and that's a passive tame. All you need for that is um. Apparently you drop eggs and run away, but they've got to be end game creature eggs, which doesn't make that much sense. I mean, catapult. What? You can catapult eggs at it. I don't think you can use dodo eggs. I think it has to be a special egg. I am a special noodle. Um, Alright, it looks like I need a lot more arrows. And that means I need a lot more thatch as well. Right, quick expedition, I guess. Oh, the crab! Yeah, I was talking about the um, basilisk. Um, yeah. I don't know what use I'd have for a crab. Are they fast or are they slow? I know I've seen different size crabs and some of them look scary. I'm just gonna have to run, you can't carry my weight, I'm too heavy. Um, I don't know if there's Sergeant Tavis is in this map. I know there are Spinos, but there are no T-Rexes. They can leap? Are you saying they can jump after you? That's terrifying. Yeah, I've seen them run around with like other dinosaurs in their hands. That's always been a, a highlight. Okay, 200 thatch. I feel like I need so much more though. Maybe I should have just put my points in uh, damage. If I'm playing the island, I'll like go to the center. And I'll get that heaps pretty map. And I'll train 10 Argies just in case there's an alpha around. And then I'll be too scared to send them in, so I'll just like use a Rex instead. It's a vicious cycle. Alright, one, two. Oh god, I still need so much more. God, I think it's going to be a lot more fun just killing the Basilisk if that's how hard they're going to make it. Alright, how many arrows can I make now? Uh, arrows cost... Two thatch, so I can make 300 arrows. Oh, look at you! You came... You can carry my weight. Bless you. I didn't even call, did I? No. Um. Alright, well, if you want to see uh, me lose all my hard work, I think I'm ready to tame up one more trike, and with four trikes and four stegos, attempt to down a basilisk. They all have saddles, so maybe that's gonna 
Oh, I can just send the dodos in. I might send a test dodo in, actually. If you can dodge a dodo, you can dodge my attack. <laughs> Arc 2, you mean, um, Genesis 2? I think Diablo 2 will be out by then, so I probably won't see any arc. <laughs> wrong with the old game? What are they even going to do to make an arc 2? Is it just going to be a Subnautica with an arc title? Yeah, they literally just bought part 2 of Genesis out. I got some people at work that were playing it and they were telling me how it was all quests and things and I was like, I play solo, I'd probably enjoy the quests. Alright. Let's tame a strike. Should I go for a re really high level one? I haven't played Gen, I've only played Aberration. But it looks so much fun. I mean, the island, Ragnarok, and Aberration. Alright, if it takes more than 40 tranks, I don't want it. Um, what's the difference between a Ravager and a, uh, Raptor? A Ravager's a lot more health, or...? <coughs> Alright. So, I have got my... That, whatever that is. Uh, I'm gonna deposit my thatch. I'm gonna throw that out, I don't need any more of that. Ah, oh, so they're like wolves, so they're really strong. So like at base, they'd probably have a few hundred health and really high bleed attack damage. So they're probably twice as strong as raptors, yeah? Great, you got my berries, don't you? There you go. Um, are they easy to kill and tame and whatnot, or are they a bit of a challenge? Like, can they climb? Can you kill them in a tower? What's their play? Okay, level two. Oh, wow, so high level. The joys of playing, um, default settings. Four. Maybe I should get the, um, parasiculums, whatever they call them. Let's have a look if I can do a saddle. Because I know you can make a base on them. Level 50. Or are they Parises? I think that... no. Uh, maybe that's a regular saddle and the other one's a saddle base. Um, I might try to beat this map. I'm not sure yet. So far I just want to absolutely annihilate the... Uh, Basilisks. <coughs> oh, a raptor egg. Oh, there's another one. Oh god, how many are there? Or is that the same one that moved? So I've got a tower in the middle. Um, vanilla got upgraded quite a lot. You level up. I'm level like 50 and this is after only a few hours of playing this game. Like, they make it harder when you're in a multiplayer map. And PvP map. Oh god, there's one. That's a level 28. Then what the hell is this one? Is that a different one? Oh lord. Yeah, it is. Please tell me they fight each other. I love Fallout 4. I might actually play that again. I will attack. I just need one more horn boy with a big horn. Um, 
I might actually make a separate video of how to kill them because there are no how to kill guides. Um, I'll try for my tower for the first playthrough and then I will try to uh, invade them with dinosaurs for my next one. Because I know that if you have a shield I think it reduces fireball damage. No, it's only the same one. Alright. I'm not sure how much damage a Dippo does, but I wouldn't mind putting a saddle on it and just sending it to war. Um, I was going to play Fallout 4 in VR, but I just, I don't know. I think I'm having more fun playing it non-VR. God, I don't even know what a Dippo eats. Alright, I'm going to attempt to tame one of these guys. Um... I wouldn't have the slightest idea how to go after them. So I know they're fast, I know I can't outrun them. God, I hate my damn mushrooms. Stop punishing me. Yeah, um... I've been playing a fair bit of DVD, but I took a break because I prefer to play a multiplayer with people. And not many people that I play with have been on. They're all playing Lame Killers or playing uh, that new Final Fantasy game. Alright, I got that music queuing. I might actually have to just tame this low, low level. Just because I can't find any more. Uh, with a saddle on and some levels in him, he shouldn't be terrible. He's still going to be a meat axe at the end of the day. However, a high level Dodicarus can't catch me and they've got a lot of health. Um, I wonder what the range is on a Basilisk attack. Because I'm really keen to give my tower an, an, an attempt. God, it looks so bad. Um, do you think if I move to one end of that tower, his blast won't hit me? I'm gonna try it. I'm gonna have a quick look. I'm gonna go for a suicide attempt. Um, not have pets. I know lots of cats but I do not have pets myself. I'm not allowed to have pets where I am. Fiber. Wood. Plus being an immortal and having cats means lots of them would pass away and I'd be very upset. Alright. Let's go. Let's go to our deaths. I try to make my tower one more level high. Um, maybe not, but I will try to do one more platform, I think. Just on the off chance I can uh, sidestep. Uh, no, Basilisk cannot 
Kurt Stone. God, would anyone even play this game if they could? Oh god. I'm not even gonna have a chance to get to my tower. No, it sees me. Why is it beelining to me? Oh no, I haven't played Kerno. going near my base. Come back. Uh oh. Let's see if I can get its attention. Wow, come on. Oh, I didn't tell me I get stuck like alphas do. Oh, it's getting stuck like an alpha. So, it does that thing where it just keeps eating the same thing. Today's guide, how to kill an alpha. How to kill a basilisk. Wait till it's eating and just shoot it in the head. At this point, maybe I should just get my dinos to come and kill it. But I think I've got a wall in the way. They're not even going to be able to get here unless I assemble them outside. That's got to be a thousand damage. Do you know how much damage they get when they level up health? Alright, see you later, Dark Wolf. Man, if it's that distracted, I wonder if my uh, Raptor Squad will do anything against it. Uh, take it easy, Dark Wolf. God, it's not even bleeding. What? Is it healing? Let me at it, I want the big snake. Daddy can't be the only one with a big snake. Wow, wow, wow. Uh oh. It comes!
Where'd it go? What? What? How? How did you fudge up that badly? I'm out of arrows. Now it's pretending to hibernate. There we go. What? Why can't I jump up? <laughs> nope, got me. So it can attack really, really high apparently. So, I've got 250 health and that took two hits. So I can't be that strong. I say that. What armor can I make? I can make fiber and hide armor. Oh yeah, I'm gonna unleash the army, alright. I don't have a choice, I think it's coming. Oh no, wait, I needed those mushrooms, I'm gonna go dehydrated. Um, so we need to make armor, hide, and fiber. Fiber, fiber, hide. Why not? Let's go for the Van Pelt look. Oh, what? I didn't apply it. Interesting. There we go. Alright, I guess I need to unleash the army sooner or later. Um, I just need mushrooms first because I'm going to die of dehydration otherwise. Probably not the best time to attack at night time. I said I needed mushrooms, so why am I here? Okay, got some mushrooms. Um, I've got a light thing, I just forgot to equip him, the uh, pet. I'm only really after the aquatic mushrooms, which are 69, there we go, it's got a map. Um, Alright, that's me done. Alright, let's uh, give this a go.
It's gonna be an absolute massacre. How many things do you reckon I should take? Do you reckon I should have my raptors or do you reckon that's just a death sentence? Uh, I'll have nothing if I take all of them. Look, I'm gonna keep this guy. I think. <laughs> I'm gonna leave this track behind, actually. The staggers are way too slow to do anything. I won't be able to ride them because they don't move. I suppose if he comes towards me. Um, do you know what the difference between the modes are for them? Like, uh... Hardened plate? Is heavy plate the tank one? Or is it, um... Hardened? Which one? Heavy? What the hell did my little light finger? Oh, there you are. So one twelve thousand twelve six six. Also, if I kill a basilisk up here, they respawn at level 1. Hey, they shouldn't respawn at a high level. Let's see how much a Stego Saddle goes for. Wood hide fiber. Oh, I don't have enough wood. Um, Alright, uh, should I go get some more wood first and make a proper saddle? two more saddles for them then.
Should have pumped some points into fortitude. Let's do this. Should I actually bring all my things? What do you reckon the chances are of me actually beating the Basilisk? Alright. I'm gonna restart my stream, because if this is successful I'm gonna upload it to YouTube. How to beat a uh... Basilisk on default settings. So I will be right back. I am just going to restart this stream. 